Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing fabulously. I myself am a bit stressed, a bit fatigued, um, and very hungry. I am, um, in fact, traveling back to London, which is both exciting and quite terrifying. Like, of course, like traveling in these times just isn't really ideal and maybe not the smartest things to do. Um, but I just felt that I really needed to get back because I was not doing too well at home. I just needed to get back to my friends at Connaught and like regain my like study motivation because I've been a mess when it comes to that. But yeah, anyways, uh, my travel itinerary, like my travel route back to London is of course quite complicated because of Corona. Love that. Um, I have to first go to Stockholm, which is where I'm at now. And then tomorrow I'm taking a flight to Helsinki in Finland. And then from Finland to London, which is like, which, which makes no sense, of course, because Finland is like the other way around. But yeah, anyways, that was the only route that like went out of Sweden, which is insane. But like, yeah, un understandable. Anyways, now I am actually at a hotel. Um, I didn't really want to risk like my flight being like really delayed tomorrow from Gothenburg to Stockholm so I decided to come up to Stockholm today instead and just like spend the night here and like be ready and set for tomorrow. I thought I'd give you guys a little bit of a room tour. Um, it's not the grandest of places but who am I to complain? I am in fact travelling back to London. So yeah, this is me. My hair's looking a bit crazy because I've not have not had any like wax in it. And then also, I actually dyed my hair. Can you see? I dyed it like I mean the light. I dyed it like a few days ago. A bit blonde up because I absolutely despise my winter hair. It's just a bit too dark for my liking. So anyways, here's the hotel. Here's my coat, my bags. Bathroom actually pretty fresh. I'm definitely not complaining. The view here is a quite intriguing though. Like instead of being from like view outside, it's just like a view into like a shopping mall. But anyways, we love that. We love a bit of shopping. Much better version of like McDonald's or Burger King. It's a lot better, a lot more fresh, just a lot more yummy. So I'm excited for that. I might get some burgers, some fries, Coca-Cola Zero. We'll see, we'll see. Um, but yeah, we'll do that. And maybe after we'll that, just eat that and just chill in my bed. Who knows? Who knows? I had my food and I could not be more excited. <laughs> I am, I'm really excited for this. Okay, so what did I get is now the question. I got, here's the yummy, yummy bag. I got some, um, what's it called? Truffle, truffle mayo. They don't have that in England. Got some fries, if you can see here. And then I actually got the burger, even a double burger. I did splurge a teeny weeny bit. Made a bit more filling. Oh, doesn't look too enticing, if you see. <laughs> but it's, I promise you guys, it is absolutely delicious. I've had this before, so I know. Anyways, I'm gonna enjoy my delicious, d deliciously, delicious looking meal, and um, then probably watch some Bridgerton, which is like a Netflix series. I hope you guys have seen it because it's amazing. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna watch some of that and then probably go to bed. See you later.
I'm back at Connor's Hall in my accommodation. I feel so happy. This is my tiny little room that I absolutely adore. I the tube went well from Heathrow. I'm finally back where I belong, lol. Um and yeah, I'm just kind of settling down. You start packing a bit. Okay, maybe I'll give you a more extensive room tour, so, sorry. So here's my bed. Obviously I couldn't did not have the energy to make my bed before I left. We're just gonna ignore that. Um here we have a little wee like sink. Like some other random stuff. Oh, my wardrobe. It's not pretty useful. And then, of course, like my desk, my ugly fake plant that's still super cute. Just look at this. Oh, look at these little cute photos. Oh, I am honestly so happy to be back. I just needed this, I feel like. Um, I'm actually getting a bit hungry, but because, of course, I have to self quarantine. I don't know what I'm going to do because I'm going to be stuck in my room for 10 days, which is quite frightening. But I mean, I have done it before. I did it last term. <clears throat> but yeah, I might, might take a shower, actually. I feel like that's needed. Update, guys. My Uber Eats order has just arrived. Um, due to the fact that I'm in quarantine, I, of course, I can't really go out and like buy yummy food so I had to order in today but anyways I'm so excited I'm going to show you guys what I bought I went for Chinese food I've been craving it all day so that is what I got I ordered quite a lot I ordered like two full servings um, but like because I have a mini fridge which you can see here I can just like put everything that I, that I don't finish in that and like have it for like lunch, because I don't get lunch from my my calls. I do have a get breakfast and dinner. So going to get that delivered to me. But anyways, I'm super excited. I don't really know what it is. Oh, wait. I've had this before. It's like some, um, I don't know, like with some oyster sauce, some chicken, some sauteed veggies. Ah, oh, it's so delicious. Anyways, okay, so that's that one. And this other thing, like some Miao Tian. My friend Skylar recommended me. Shout out Skylar, I miss you so much. Um, she recommended this to me. It's like some noodle like stir fry. Anyways, I'll give you guys an update on how I found these deliciously smelling dishes. The bags have been unpacked. My room is relatively tidy, I would say. I've actually made my bed look super comfy. Um, Oh yeah, and the dinner was absolutely delicious. For any of you people who live in London, I would definitely recommend, what's it called this? It's called like Fat Boy, like Fat Boy? I don't know, it's called something like that, but it's like this Chinese restaurant. And it was absolutely delicious. I was so impressed. I stored my leftovers in this mini refrigerator, so I'm gonna have them tomorrow for lunch. And um, now really, I'm just gonna, um, get into bed and read some more of my favorite book, which is Lord of Shadows, basically like a Morsel Instruments book. Hello guys, it has now been three days since I arrived back in London. I am I'm currently, of course, still in self-isolation. And I've really like not been up so much. I've just been studying a bit, like doing a bit of work. Just stuff like that. Um, I thought I'd end this video here, um, but I am actually going to film like a kind of a quarantine with me video where like where I um, take you guys along on how my days in quarantine are. Um, I'll find some things, some interesting things for us to do. Don't you worry. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, um, and I'll see you guys soon.